Hey guys, this is podcast of the. We call it the podcast because we couldn't come up with a better name. Just like that one SpongeBob episode, just the. <laughs> there was a SpongeBob episode called just called the. No, no, yeah. not the. But uh, yeah. So there's this episode. SpongeBob had to write a thing, and he only managed to write the. Oh, I know what you're talking about. It was his uh, driving. Yeah, I remember now. Yeah, we don't do writing anymore. Now we got computers. <laughs> we have typing. Yeah. So. Yeah. So this podcast is basically you can talk about whatever, and all that. So. We have we have absolutely no script. We will be talking over each other. We will be silent. We will leave everything in. Yes, uncut, raw footage. This is all uncut. What do you mean by footage? It's just a black screen. Yeah. And <laughs> this is footage. <laughs> it's footage of a black screen. Yes. This is exactly it. What? Okay. Yeah. Anyways, so, uh, first off, we will, before we get into our topic today, how are you today? How are you today, my fine sir? Oh, I'm I'm doing just fine. Nice. Uh, how, how how about you? Uh, well, I got a few sunburns, but besides that, I'm all good. Oh, I don't get sunburned. You know why? Because I don't leave the house. Yeah, I was forced to be outside once, but eh, it was enjoyable, I guess. So. Even when I'm like out in the sun, I'm I'm wearing clothes, so. <laughs> Uh, yeah. So there, no sunburn for me, thanks. I'll I'll pass. Yeah. All right. So today's topic is horror. Ooh, scary. Horror. Yeah. Today's topic is horror. <laughs> yeah, horror. Well, today we're talking about horrors. Horses. No horrors. Ah, ah, uh, yes, horrors. <laughs> What's your opinion on whores? Oh, I think they're great. Oh, they're fantastic. They're great to society. <laughs> ah, yes. Lovely. No. Lovely, lovely people. But yeah. No, scary stuff. Woo, insert lightning here. Boom, bang. Crash. Flash. Uh, it's a black screen. Use your imagination. Yeah. Uh, Ooh. Boom. Wait, hold on. Okay. <laughs> Lovely. I, I, I did a thing. Oh, yeah, no, no audio got picked up, so... Oh, wait, hold on. Is your noise suppression on? Um, I don't know. I didn't, I didn't see any settings uh, for my well, microphone. Well, recreate it with your mouth. <laughs> um, wait. Did you hear anything? I heard a little bit of something, but not a whole lot. God damn it. Okay. Never mind. Um, well, I was just like... Uh, wait. God damn it. Why does it pick up? No idea. Because I'm like, you know, tapping really fast with my fingers and stuff, like on my computer. Like, and like, like this? And I don't know why it's not picking up. Oh, weird. Well. Because that was supposed to be thunder, I guess. Uh. Anyway, today's topic is horror, as we already mentioned. Yeah. So, yeah, so today's story today is about uh, this recent thing about YouTube. With this watch thing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You, I remember you were like, you texted me. And you were like, hey, if you just remove the H and watch, it takes you somewhere weird. It was all creepy. And I did. And I was like, oh, that's great. Yeah, honestly, I thought that was a little weird because I didn't know that you two could do that. I didn't know that was a thing. I, If you had never told me, I would have never known. Yeah, because I first saw it on a Reddit and it was like a, like a big deal, like 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 in a meme format kind of thing. So, 
Yeah. I so, wonder how they. I wonder how you find out about that sort of thing. Do they just do it on accident, and then? Yeah. So about that. So yeah. So the thing is, the uh, the original video was not. Well, maybe not like a snippet, but it's like a part of this thing a long time ago, back in the internet, where like somewhere in the two thousands kind of era, where uh, there was this thing like guest six 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 thing. Like, have you heard about that? Once. Uh, I think so, yeah. Yeah, so basically, I think it was where you would, like, refresh YouTube a bunch until it gets all, ooh, scary, messed up, and all that. And it was, like, like the very popular thing at the time, way back when. Uh, no, that's just... Oh, yeah, no, username... 666 by yeah from yeah 14 years ago uh yeah it was like yeah, it was like like an art project i suppose uh it's an art project i didn't know that yeah and in a little bit and i'm going to send it to you don't i mean you can play it later but yeah so the artist was made this video cuz originally it was for some other website, and and he and this guy wasn't from like the U.S. or anything, so it was like a completely different website. But since like for English users and whatever, I think it got converted into YouTube. And oh, isn't it like a Japanese yeah thing? Yeah, it was. But I think I've seen the video, and I remember it's like Japanese. Yeah, and so basically, uh. A little bit of the, ooh, the creepy whatever this was. Uh, yeah, so that, ooh, remove the H thing and it'll show you this weird video. Um, yeah, so that little, yeah, like, that little snippet of that whatever it was is in that video. And, yeah. Yeah, that, that's weird. Yeah, and so, and this guy who posted this... Which his channel is called Six Six Six, uh, yeah, you know, H whatever. But apparently, this guy was linked to some other account, which apparently, um, for some reason, apparently, this person was able to, oops, that's not what I want. Was able to, if I can get this up here. So apparently they were able to like duplicate accounts and all that somehow. And um Yeah, and apparently and this is like an old YouTube channel apparently. It was like somewhere in like the beginning of uh beginning of YouTube basically. And, uh, uh yeah. Oh. Oh. No, I don't want to subscribe. No. Oh, maybe they... Oh. Okay. So, this watch thing. So, I think maybe it got it fixed or something. Because now it leads me to something completely different. Does it not work anymore? I don't know. It just takes me to something or somewhere completely different. Um, huh. yeah, yeah. But but this guy basically, yeah, it just takes me to somewhere completely different. But oh my god, what? I just sneezed. <laughs> what if I just look it up? Oh yeah, no, it just it takes me to somewhere. Completely different. Yeah, so I think they got this remo removed. Ew. Yeah, so... Uh... Yeah, so basically... This guy, like, was somehow able to, like, duplicate their channel with the same amount of subscribers, same join date, same everything. We don't know how he did it, but... Yeah, apparently there was a little of that. And apparently had, like, some other things that one time. I, I can't remember what time it was. But, 
somewhere in YouTube history, he did something completely different with the YouTube URL thing, but yeah, I don't know, or I don't remember, so. <coughs> yeah, honestly, I thought that was quite interesting about how you can change the URL for that. Yeah, I wonder how that was discovered, like. Yeah, like. I don't, I don't know. Yeah, like, who has, like, who thought of something about, like, hmm, you know what, I feel like removing the A, or the C, or H in watch. Like, who, like, did someone, is, like, someone just, like, super bored, and then they just discover it? Yeah, like, who just thinks of that? <laughs> like, what? It's, like, the, like, the person, like, in the right time, in the right place, at the right moment, or something. Kind of deal. Yeah. And it's, like, what... <laughs> Yeah. Ah, <sighs> strange times. Speaking of, uh, also YouTube things. So recently, uh, I've been exploring more or less like the dark side of YouTube, or something. Right? Yeah. Yeah. So there's like, more more like not like ARG. Oh, maybe no, no, no. Okay, not ARG things, but. Like, there are some YouTubers that, like, died for no reason, or YouTube channels that are, like, they have, like, ooh, back, back, like, horrifying things by this channel or something, right? Uh, and there was this one YouTuber that I could get into about. Which I don't even know if I should. But. Like there was. Um. Uh, uh. Something about. I don't know. So basically. There was this one thing. On YouTube that I wanted to explore. Uh, like. So you know the dark web right? Yeah. Yeah so there was this one thing. About. So there's this one YouTube video that I saw about, and this is old, right? People are probably already talked about it or whatever, but I just want to like look at it and explore because I haven't really watched a whole lot of it. So, yeah, so it was basically, um, there's like this guy or whoever it was, who, this, like, there's, there's, like, this, like, person in, like, a trash bag or something, like, like, just, like, a body or something, right? Oh, wait, was it, like, uh, I feel like I know what you're talking Yeah, and it was, like, just, like, this, like, camera footage of some kind, I think. Uh, well, I remember hearing a story, because you said, like, tell me if this is um, what you're referring to, because um, I heard a story one time of, like, these, like, TikTokers who, I, they did, they were on, like, some kind of app, and it was, like, they told them to go to some location, mm -hmm. and they found, like, body parts in, like, plastic bags and, like, a suitcase or something like oh, that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so, uh, it was with an app, supposedly, and I have this app, and it's just a bunch of nonsense, really. Um, something Nautica. Uh, oh, let me look. Oh, yeah, Randonautica. That's that was the app. Yeah. So it was, was it okay? So what well, was it like a quest sort of thing or like treasure hunt? Okay. So basically, what this app was is it will generate a random place in the world that's like near you, basically. Uh huh. And it'll take you somewhere like I don't know somewhere in the middle of nowhere or somewhere completely different. And basically, it'll be like. You can find something interesting or nothing at all. And you can find a bunch of YouTube videos on this. And 
I didn't necessarily look myself because, you know, I don't want to go out alone in the dark or anything because, you know, you know, people, you know, people, that's it, just people. Uh, <laughs> Um, yeah, it'll just generate whatever, and you go to there, and, yeah, and, the, and this one time, you know, like, with the suitcase thing, like, you know, like, there was parts, they didn't find the guy who did it, though, I, I, at least I don't think, but, yeah, I don't know, I thought it was weird, uh, decided to look for it myself, it was also kind of weird, I'd say, but, yeah. I mean, was that where you were talking about in the first place? It just kind of reminded me of... Yeah, no, I'm talking about something completely different, where... It, where this guy had, like, these cameras set up. And basically, where this camera would always keep looking at this, like, this body bag of this, this, one, this person, which I think was supposed to be a woman of some kind. Or some person. Okay, that's another creepy video that I might talk about later. So, um, yeah, so, it was like a, I don't know, like, called him by something. Maybe, like, a, by, like, a flower, I think. Oh, it was, like, it was, I think I know what you're talking about. It's, like, Daisy or something. Yeah, I think so. And, basically, like, they follow, not follow, but it'll just, like, show... Like something, like it shows, like it follows this body bag around, like, like around the house, and I don't know. I'm trying to to explain it in a way where it's like where it won't get me in trouble on YouTube or yeah. So... Oh, you'll be okay. I'm just trying not to get massacred on YouTube. Uh, so, I don't know. So, basically, like, you can see, like, this body, like, like going around the house. No, this isn't it. No, 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 no. Okay, I can't find it, but it was somewhere. Ew. No, um... So it goes around, it tries to, like, move around, tries to do something. And it's like that for, like, the rest of the video. Uh-huh. And I think it, I remember this vaguely, but, I'd like, the last video, like, the body escapes. As in, like, it's still in the bag. But, I mean, it stopped moving, I mean, it stopped moving for, I don't know how many episodes ago. But, like, the door opens, and then, poof, gone. Like, she escapes or something. That's like, weird. Yeah. I don't, like... I don't know, like, people are saying, like, I don't, they don't know if it's real or if it isn't. And I don't know. I personally think... I, I, I want to say that it's not real, but in, you know, in the back of my head, it's like, uh, I don't know if it's real or, or, or not. So, it's just those things. Yeah, I don't know. And then there's this one that I have up. Let me. I don't know. If this will keep get me. Hate that already. So there's this person. What is this? So this video that I just pulled up. It's called White House. Why you never became a dancer. It's just this person, like this image, like moving. With like the, like these like weird black eyes or something, and it's like, say like just doing random audio. I could show you that real quick. Um, the name of that sounds familiar. Yeah, it's just this, and I'm not gonna play a whole lot of. <laughs> oh, it. I know, I know what that is. Yeah, I've seen that. Yeah, it's really odd, and there was also like this one channel. That I've seen of some person with like a mannequin. Like that. What is this? 
There's no comments. I think, okay, the comments are disabled, but that is funky. I am not showing that or talking about that. That just doesn't look right. So, yeah, but this is the person with the mannequin story. I think, like, this person, like, used to be an actress. And she was, like, like very lonely, I guess. And she kind of, like, spent time with this, uh, this mannequin. Uh... And basically, this mannequin, this mannequin was, like, dressed up funky and had, like, makeup all over its face. And she, like, like she, like, sang with it, danced with it. Like, I don't know if I know what you're talking about. I don't know. Hold on. Let me... Uh, YouTube woman dancing with mannequin. I don't know if I spelled mannequin right. Nope. No, nope, that is not it. Not it, not it. I don't know. I can't find it. I'm just feeling I'm just seeing like that old those old those YouTubers that wear a, like a weird mannequin thing and the whatever. I don't know. But Yeah, I don't know. Um Oh, well, while I'm looking for other stuff, do you have any dark stuff that you've ever found or anything of the sorts um well i don't have any dark things related to youtube but i did want to say that this episode of the podcast has been sponsored not actually sponsored by walmart no no my air conditioner no no and <laughs> the moon well besides walmart yes we have been sponsored by the air conditioner and the moon itself well, don't worry. I, I said not actually sponsored. Oh, oh, good. I didn't. I didn't hear that part. But <laughs> yeah, we're we're sponsored by Walmart. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we you know just buy all their buy buy all their crap. Yeah. No. Um. Hmm. Okay. So, oh, you know, what I just thought of. Um, Mario. No. Uh, sorry. Uh, there was, oh, I found a banger. Yeah, so, you know, the dark oh, you web. Found a banger, huh? Yeah, so before I go into this, uh, so you, are you familiar with the dark webs, or the deep webs, the dank webs? Uh, I'm familiar with the concept, but I've never actually been there myself. So... Uh, supposedly, um, they use it for drugs, illegal things, and, and all of the sorts, right? And, you know, and every now and then you, you just come across just, just, like, random crap. Yes. Yeah. So, and I think, and I might go into this later, but... Like with this, it's like YouTube. Like I'm not gonna be talking about YouTube for the ty this entire thing, but I'm just dipping my toes into like a little bit of, like the dark side of YouTube about like some videos and whatever. So there's this video by Parker Wright, which is a guy who dresses up in a plague doctor, and I think this is like some ARG thing. Yeah, I've, I've seen this one before. Yeah, and the first video that I have up from 2015 on the 30th of September is 11BX1371. And, and, and people already talked about this. This is old news. But I just like to touch it on it because, you know, I find it interesting, I guess, right? So. Yeah. So basically, this video just shows uh, the camera following the this uh, plague doctor he's in some abandoned building he does something I don't know what he does I'm just skipping by some stuff but the audio is basically like something that's like converted into like I don't know an image I guess like 
you know, like these like these weird sounds, but if you put it through like a spectrogram, you get like this weird image. Yeah. Yeah, so this first video is basically uh, the audio is basically like something like very inappropriate, which I'm not going to say on here. But I will put it in Discord though. And don't say it out loud. But basically it's that. So <laughs> Oh. Yeah. So yeah, okay. yeah, I think that's the only video that does that. But yeah, so that's that for YouTube. <laughs> well, almost that for YouTube. Okay, never mind. It is it is that for YouTube? I could touch on some like dead YouTubers that have like dark stuff behind it, but I think that could get me a bit in trouble, probably. So I'm probably. Yeah, hey, you'll be fine. Okay, well there's this one YouTube channel that was kind of like sad. Uh, wait, Elvis Presley had a YouTube channel? Oh, yeah, he does. Sorry, uh... <laughs> there was this one kid that, that died a few years ago. Some people already know him. But... If I can find him... Hold on, wait. My computer is not making good noises. Um. Well, maybe you should just tell it to make good noises. Yeah. Hey, computer, be nice for me, please. Like, you're never like this. Maybe because I'm recording. But. I don't know. There's something dilly. Hold on, let me. Yeah, Harley Dilly. Yeah, I, mean, I know what you're talking. I yeah. Know what you're talking about. So, do you know anything about this YouTube thing, this YouTube channel? Yeah, I saw a whole video on it maybe a year or two ago. Yeah. So basically, yeah, Harley Dilly. He was a kid. He has 52 videos. He has about 8,000 subscribers. Um, yeah, he came from... Ohio. Yeah, he was the age of... 14, I think? I could be wrong. Yeah, so apparently, he was found missing... In during 2019, on December 20th. Mm -hmm. My computer is not happy. Yeah, but basically, uh, his parents were like not good to him, basically. Right? Yeah. And so. Yeah, so, I mean, I'm talking about a dead YouTuber, by the way. Just saying this right now. Uh, he was found dead in a chimney after going missing for almost a month. Which, oh my. Yeah. yeah so, computer, calm down, man. Yeah, so... <laughs> Yeah, so now, yeah, there is that that I wanted to discuss a little bit about, which I found a little sad, but also kind of dark, because, I don't know, it wasn't that dark, but now the deep web, dark web area. So have you ever had experience, oh wait, did I already say that? Yes. Okay. Yep. So, so what have, have you, like, heard about it, like, in general? The dark web? Yeah. Well, I've heard very interesting and scary stories from it. Yeah. Um, 
I've heard stories about drug trafficking, human trafficking, hiring hitmen. Um, what else? Uh, live streams, which uh. are always fun. Uh, yeah. I've heard a lot. Yeah, oop. Uh, okay, so... Yeah, so I thought, you know... Basically, from what I've seen, it's basically just buying stuff that you can't really normally buy on the normal internet. And, you know, there's like, ooh, Red Rooms, or Hitmans, or whatever, right? But today, I want to talk about this, like, very popular, like, website that used to be on the deep web, but now it's on the, the surface web. And you might have heard it before, and I might have told you it once, but something called... Terminal zero zero. Have you ever so have you heard about this or not? Yeah, you were you were telling me about it a few years ago. Yeah, so and, and apparently it still gets updated, surprisingly. But um Yeah, so apparently there, I don't know a whole lot about it because I try to delve deep into the lore, and because apparently there's a story going on, and they even have like a Discord channel too. But basically, there's something about probes and terminals because you got Terminal Zero Zero, you got Terminal One One One, I think, Terminal Nine 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 Nine, and some other things. And you know, I could be wrong about this. And, hey, it's been a while, been years. Um, basically, it was something about, um, uh, something about, like, COS, I think. And about, like, something, I don't know, corruption, I guess. Probes around the world. Like, millions or even billions of probes around the world, I think. Uh, I don't really know or remember a whole lot. But there's something about, like, Dolls or something. Oh. Yeah. I don't really remember yeah, entirely. I, yeah, I don't remember you saying anything about that, but... Yeah, there's something about dolls and anime, whatever, but and then everything else. There's, like, probes, death, graves, meat, sacrifices, or whatever. And it talks about the gate, which I don't know what that is. And I don't think I want to know, but I also want to know at the same time because of curiosity. But, honestly, I have no idea because I don't remember. It's been years ago. I'm too lazy to look at it right now. But, yeah, maybe you guys in the comments could figure it out. I don't know. And maybe there's already people that already figured it out. I don't know. But, because I've delved into it one time and I've, I have uncovered some secrets every now and then and it's like it's like this puzzle thing that I couldn't really figure out had some friends help me and it always keeps it's like it's, it's like a loophole I guess but yeah I don't know um yeah so uh, co-host do you have any thoughts on this terminal zero zero thing before we move on to something else very weird. Okay. Uh. That's it. All right. <laughs> that, that that true that. So. All right. So now we're gonna go into something where. Oh, hold on. Let me think. I briefly forgot it. Oh yeah. A no. Hold on. Wait. Uh, I'm having a brain fart real quick. Oh, yeah. Stories. Yeah, so... What in our time, like, in our lives, like, scared the crap out of us? Or... Or just something... Or, like, maybe you saw something scary in general. Demons. Or ghosts. Or whatever. Um... Well... I, I have something scary happen every single day. Yeah? It's called... Looking in the mirror. 
Oh. Um. Yeah, it, it's terrifying. Man. I don't like. I don't like what I see. Must be hard. Yeah. Um. Normally, when your reflection. Normally, when you look at your reflection, uh, it's supposed to move with you. You know. Um. But mine. My mine. Just, it. It it doesn't move with me, and its face gets all weird. Oh uh, yeah. Yeah, you know, like whenever like you look in a mirror, it always feels like you're looking at someone like completely different, like someone that's unknown, a stranger. Yeah. Yeah, cause like you know, I think we all tried this before, where like you look in the mirror in the dark, and you can see like your face slowly shift. Yeah. Yeah, I tried it. Honestly, quite boring. Because, I mean, like, there's not a whole lot that happens. I mean, you can see your face change. I mean, yeah, you might get a little freaked out, but, I mean, meh. Um, yeah. I don't know. What about ghosts? Any paranormal things happen? Um, not that I can really think of. See, I'm not a huge believer in ghosts or anything uh, like that. I see. Yeah, because, I mean, like, I don't think ghosts exist personally, but I think demons are a thing. Right? I believe in, you believe in demons, but not ghosts. Well, okay, so what, so, I'm the guy who's like, Okay, like, if someone dies, they move on to the afterlife, right? But demons, like, they like to, like, trick people. They like to mess around with people and try to hurt them in some way, right? So, okay. my idea is that they disguise as random people and try to, like, trick them in thinking that, oh, it's their loved ones or something. And yet, like, they can still, like, try to hurt them in a way, I guess, right? Because you know how, like, every now and then, like, like a bottle almost tries to get thrown at you or something? Or... Uh-huh. Yeah. And so, basically, the, de the demons will, like, they want fear, right? They, they like, they love fear. Like, they love the stuff. And, like, they want to make you afraid. I guess. Because... I, I suppose. Yeah. Uh, they, wanna, they want to freak you out. Yeah, because, I mean, like, if, if you're interacting with a ghost, right, they might seem nice, but, I mean, like, like, they're, like, they would, like, move stuff and probably, like, break stuff and haunt you in some way, right? Because... Because that's our, how ghosts are in, like... Like, let's say, like, you go to, like, a haunted house or something. Like, or, or, or those, ooh, 3 a.m. videos. I, I mean, okay, 3 a.m. videos, those are fake, but, like, if you find something that's, like, like, actually paranormal, which I can find every now and then, and I usually, uh -huh. like, because I, I usually double check with stuff, right? Because, like, if something's fake, I want to know that it's fake or not, so... But, yeah, and so, because whenever something that's, like, like, real enough, I guess, like, they can have, like, I don't know, like, like, scratches on their marks, or on their body, or just, like, you know, there's some, I don't know, stuff like that, and you can get, like, nightmares or something, and it's just, like, ooh, scary or whatever. Just like, have you ever been to a place that is supposedly haunted? Um, uh, maybe. Okay. Yeah, because I've been on a thing where there's like this, like, haunted mansion of some kind, right? Ooh, very original. But, like, I was like, I don't know, five, four years old at the time. And, like, 
Like, because we went in, the thing was, like, dusty as heck. And the funny thing was, is that they had, like, a convenient, like, graveyard near them for some reason. And, uh-huh. yeah, and I don't know where this was. Like, I don't know what state it was in, but it was it was quite far away from Iowa. I know that. But, basically, uh, and I think we have footage of this somewhere. I don't know, my dad used to have it. But, because we went with our cousins, I was there. Uh, yeah, creepy stuff happened. We caught a voice on camera, which basically just said hello there, which I remember fondly for some reason. Don't know why. Thought it was creepy. Uh, stuff moved around. Ooh, very, ooh, scary. And then, I, you know, then once we were done, we went outside and stayed in the graveyard, I guess. So. Huh. Yeah. And then, actually, when we got home, apparently this ghost followed me and my dad to home. And apparently, it, like, caused a lot of distress in the house, apparently. And then we, like, cast it out or something, and then all of a sudden, it just became normal all of a sudden. Like, it became normal, but every now and then, it feels like... Like, there's, like, a presence or something. Like, like the basement... Right? Like, you've been in my basement, right? And every, like, does it feel like every now and then you feel like you're being watched by something? No, I think you're just paranoid. Yeah, probably that, but, I mean, like, like, have you ever, like, been in the basement where, like, there's, like, like a huge, like, dark corner or something? Uh-huh. Yeah, like, it feels like, like, like there's something in there, like, because it's because I usually have like the fear of where like like ooh someone could have like broken into the house or something right because you don't want to deal with an intruder they could have a gun or something right right so it's just like are they hiding in there or is there someone there I don't know because it feels like oh someone's watching or something so okay I don't uh, know yeah I don't I don't know um all right. So now we're going to move on to a topic that was like video games, I guess, right? Uh, so, so, Roblox Myths. You know about that fondly, right? Absolutely. Yeah, so, I I like, their, I like the idea. I like the concept. Right? Because, you know, mm-hmm. every now and then you get like these myths that are like like they like like nowadays right myths want attention from youtubers and all that right and yeah i find that a little dumb right and 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 also most myths are also like clowns for some reason which Uh, i honestly don't understand i mean i can understand that like ooh, like the clowns are scary and that's like a phobia and whatever but like create something original man like, I mean, yeah, your clown may be original, but, like, the story is probably going to be, like, the same in any scenario. Like, ooh, circus, or something, I don't know. Yeah. But, like, every now and then you get, like, a character that has, like, an actual, like, story. It's like an ARG kind of thing, right? Uh-huh. Because there's this one character named Rust. He's retired, by the way. But, basically, it was, like, codes, Morse code, and all of the sorts. Which I thought was pretty neat. And so, right, because like, like, because so a long time ago, I used to meet, like, like, myths that like, I don't know, like, like, I've seen myths in person, I haven't really talked to them, except for, like, this one, which I caught on camera, or something like that, that was in one of my YouTube videos, or something. I don't remember uh-huh. who, but I don't know. But I like the idea of seeing like a world like with an actual story and like like some form of effort put into it. I mean, like sometimes worlds don't have to have effort in it, right? Because because right. if you nail all like the horror elements, I guess it can be it can be pretty pretty unnerving, I suppose. Uh huh. Yeah, and so it's just like, hmm, 
I, I don't really have a whole lot of stories for this, but I thought it was interesting to go on or to talk about, I'd say, because, like, like, who are they? What's their story? Or, why do they look like that? Or, or whatever, right? Right. Like, do you have any experience of such a thing? With Roblox Myths? No. Ah. I mean, there's like a few that I liked. And there's one, something about the Watcher, but I wanna, I don't wanna talk about that at the moment. Why not? I don't know. He's he's kind of dead lately. <laughs> yeah, but I heard from the guy that he was going to make a new project kind of thing, like a like a rebirth or something. No, uh, but yeah. Um. Yeah. Now we're going to go into more of like realistic, like real life kind of things. Uh, phobias. Everyone loves phobias. Oh, absolutely. Okay, now tell me, what are you afraid of besides looking in the mirror? <laughs> um, definitely heights. Maybe some, maybe some spiders. Maybe um, def definitely those. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's probably it, as far as I can think of. Because mm -hmm. I'm not really afraid of the dark or anything. Uh, yeah, because... Like, do you have any stories that could... Like, that that has, like, based around, like, heights or any fear-related things, or, or not? Um, maybe a week or two ago, I was at a friend's house, and we were playing VR... And one of them was, like, this Spider-Man game, I guess. Mm -hmm. And we had to go really high on a platform and swing from building to building. And I was... I... No. Just no. Ah, uh, yeah. Just like that one time where I showed you on this game called VR Chat, which, you know, it's a good game. But there's, like, this world where it can be, like, in planes... You can like drive around, or, or not drive around, more like like fly around. You can get like the sense of like, oh my gosh, I'm super high and I'm gonna die. Right? Yeah. Yeah, because you've been yeah. in one of those planes and you attempted to drive one. And you ever, have you ever gotten like that feeling where it's like, oh, I'm driving something and I can crash and die? Oh, definitely. Yeah. And sometimes when I'm sometimes when I'm driving my car, I'm like, I could just hit a pole right now. Yeah, so true. Or maybe like like a person can just like walk in front of you at any moment. But the pole would be more on purpose. Oh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <ooh>, okay. Well. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I'm not okay. Yeah. Most. People... I have no self-preservation. Man. Um, spiders. This was last year, I think. Um, I was laying in my bed. I was just watching some YouTube, as I do. Mm -hmm. And I felt this, like, weird, like, almost tickling sensation, like, on my collarbone. Oh, yeah. And, and it was like, I thought I saw something, like, out of the corner of my eye. Um, lo and behold, it was a spider. Oh? Yeah, it was. And I was like, okay, no, nope, I'm sleeping downstairs tonight. Yeah, f I hate spiders. Like, I had to, I have to deal with them con- well, not constantly, but, because, like, my room is downstairs, right? And if anyone, like, has ever lived, or not lived, but, like, had a room in the basement, like, you don't want to deal with spiders before going to bed. Because, like, man, like, you don't want them to be, like, on your face or, like, inside of you. Like, man, spiders. Like, but, yeah, no thanks. Yeah, because no one... Oops.
Because no one wants to deal with a spider. In any way. Like, I mean, like, yes, like, spiders can not be dangerous or whatever, but just, like, like look at them. They got eight legs, eight spider, or eight eyes. Or, I think Every spider has eight spiders. <laughs> yeah, eight spider. <laughs> spiders are made out of eight spiders, and then, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Little known fact. <laughs> yeah. But, uh, yeah, I mean, like, I, I can understand. I mean, like, they're a little, I don't know, spiders are just wonky, I guess, because I think maybe that's the why, like, the reason we hate them so much. But. I don't know. Uh, um. I know, well, and con kind of continuing my story, um, it went, like, it went, like, on my floor, because that's. Because my bed, because my mattress was right on the floor. I didn't have like a bed frame or anything. Yeah. I was just sleeping on my mattress on the floor. Mhm. Mm and it went, and it was like, and my floor, you know, it's it has like it's like floorboards. It's like wood. Um, and you know the gaps between each plank of wood, you know, they're pretty wide. Okay. Uh, and so the spider kind of went into like the in between, like a couple planks. And no. then, like, it went, like, underneath one of the planks by kind of, like, squeezing its body underneath. And I'm like, what in Ugh. the hell was that? Oh, uh, you know what that reminds me of? What? Mold spiders. What? So there's these spiders that when, like, there's, like, a point where they're, like, dead but also alive at the same time. And there's, like, this, like, they're, like, they're, like there's, like, this, like, mold covering them. And just like like a walking piece of mold. Oh. Yeah, and it, it basically like their bodies are like slowly decaying, but they're like still walking around. And they're disgusting, man. Like 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 you can like look them up, and they're just like, ugh. Zombie spiders? I think I I think they're like I think they're like zombie spiders. In a in a way, I guess. But zombie spiders only sold at your local Walmart. <laughs> no, I don't. I don't think they would sell zombie spiders at Walmart. Why not? Well, I mean, considering that a lot of people don't really like spiders, and it, and it also like involved with like mold, I guess. I mean, they don't really live for very long because they're kind of like dying. So. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna look this up. I. I'm probably gonna regret this. Yeah, I mean they don't look disgusting, but they're just like 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 a little like white fluff ball, but with legs. It's gross. Um, mold spider. Oh. Yeah. That's weird. That looks weird. Yeah, send me a picture real quick, because it's been a while since I've seen one. You can just copy the image and then paste it. Eh. This one thing says the curse of the zombie spiders. <laughs> the, that sounds like, like like a book. Um, right. Is the goal or not? Well, I looked it up on my phone, and I don't have Discord on my phone, so I'll ah. just. Ah, I see. Yeah, whatever. I can look it up later, but. Um. Well, no, I can just copy the image. Oh, all right. There we go. Yeah, those. Like, I feel feel bad for the guys, but I mean they're already dying slowly, painfully, or they can't feel yeah. anything at all. I don't know, but they're gross. But imagine one touches you. Ugh. Ew, just like anything, like a bug or anything touches you, it's like gross. Like a centipede. Those things are disgusting. You can feel all their like legs. It's gross. Oh yeah, I don't like. Um... Like those house centipedes, or like the house, but yeah, like the house centipedes. I do not like those. Uh, yeah, because there's this one time where I was at my dad's house. He, uh, like, I was going to take a shower, right? Uh huh. And apparently, the water went down the drain, and the centipede came out of the drain, and I didn't see it until it went onto my foot. Oh. Like, I could just feel it, and, uh, and, and, it, and it was already off on my foot by then. I was just like, And I was just like, man, 
I don't think I want to shower now. <laughs> so now every time I like go take a shower, I always like, okay, I want to turn on the water, wait a bit, and make sure there's no centipede down the drain. Yeah, I was showering maybe a few weeks ago. Um, and I'm, I don't know, I don't know what was going on, but it's like, I almost, it's almost like I looked away for a second, and then there's like this earwig in there. Ooh, oh, I hate wig. earwigs. Ooh. Earwigs are so weird. They're so gross. And why are they called earwigs? Do they crawl in your ear? I mean, they don't, but apparently they can. Uh, they, they wear wigs, and they live in your ear canal. <laughs> they're like, uh... They're, they're like, the way that they're wearing, it's like, the one of the ways, like, like, like George Washington, w w like, wears, or, like, someone, like, 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 in the, in British, in Britain, in London, UK, or something, I don't know, but, like, they wear, like, one of the, like, like, like those white powder rigs, wigs, the, the, yeah, the powdered wigs, there. <laughs> they're all, like, posh and proper. It's like, mm, uh, this wax tastes exquisite. Mm. Mm, yes, delectable earwax. Mm, mm, mm. You know, we should have a party near the brain. Mm, yes. <laughs> mm, yes, how many other ears have you crawled inside today, John the Third? Oh, oh, I've crawled into several ear canals within the, fa within the last several hours. Thank you for asking. You are. <laughs> You're welcome, kind sir. <laughs> I, I bid thee the best of luck in your earwax adventures. <laughs> I just want to see someone, like, if there's, like, an animator watching this, I just want to see that, like, get animated. <laughs> just sick. What if we... You know what? What if instead of calling this The Podcast, it's called Earwax Adventures, just because I said that? <laughs> the Earwax Adventures. <laughs> That's um. the name of the podcast now. Earwax <laughs> Adventures. <laughs> Uh, I don't know if we're going to stick with that, but <laughs> let's just do it. Let's do it for now, and then yeah, you're right. And if adventures. we grow to hate it, we will we will change it. Yeah, no, like, like maybe like the, like it's called the podcast, and like you put anything in front of the. It can be just be anything like the earwax adventures or the 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 something. I don't know. But the is in all caps. <laughs> just the. Wait, what if, what if every time, what if we, like, um, hold on, I'm looking this up, uh, what if every time we, uh, put the name of the podcast in the title of the video, we use this symbol at the end of it? Oh, yeah. That way it's a registered, it's a registered thing. Ah. I don't even know if we're... Are we even allowed to do that? Like, Who's gonna stop us? YouTube. <laughs> I don't think they are. I mean, considering on how small we are, I mean, I don't think they'll notice. So, I mean... See? How do, see it, it looks good. Yeah. Because, like, maybe, like, every, every, like, every other episode, we could just be the and then some random title. <laughs> just, like... Every episode, like, so, like, today it's the Erax Adventures, and the next it's, like, the... whatever. Wait, what if it's, um... What if it's this? The Blank Podcast. Um, but the word blank is just, uh, replaced with something else. <laughs> the Earwax Podcast. The Ear... The Earwax Adventures, um, the Blank Podcast, um, hold on, it's, what if we did this, um, uh, this is, this is it. <laughs> <laughs> that's our, that's our, uh, that's our, uh, official stamp of approval. That, yes, that is, that is official right there. Yeah. You should just rename your channel to uh, Register Mark. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I could, but I might, I might make like another channel for that, so we could post like vods, I guess, like shortened down, like clips of something. All the clips are just black screens. 
Ooh, 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 spiders. Ooh. <laughs> what? Out of the corner of my eye, I just see like this like little black shadowy figure. And then I look, and it just moves under my wardrobe. Ooh. What was it? A spider. It was a spider. How big was it? Uh, about like. Uh. About the size of my index, like fingernail. Oh. Ooh. It's under my wardrobe now, and I want to kill it later. It's going to feel good. But, man, I hate spiders. As soon as we're talking about, like, spiders and then earwax adventures, like, this is a spider. No, the, like, no, the spider is our listener. He's, he was listening to the podcast. He's our um, audio engineer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just laugh, and I scared my cat. <laughs> I just scared my cat by laughing. Why did that scare you? Why did that scare you? I don't know. Why did like, that scare you? It feels like animals can get scared too easily, but I think it's like for a good reason, because like survival and all that. Hey, that's the reason that a lot of people are just afraid of the dark. Yeah, I mean, it's a survival. I mean, I don't think it's like being afraid of the dark, but maybe like just being afraid of what's in the dark. Yeah, that might be a better way of putting it. Yeah, I mean, like, like, well, like, blah, 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 blah. like what I said earlier about how, like, oh, like someone could have like broken into the house, and that someone could be hiding into the dark, just like, just waiting to strike. Right. Yeah, because I'm the kind of person who doesn't want to go somewhere into the dark alone. Because, like, what if you're like walking in a forest at night? There could be like an animal. That wants to, that's like hunting you or something, or like, or some crazy person that wants to like stab you or whatever. Or a crazy person that's hunting you and an animal that wants to stab you. Exactly. See, this is the or thing. Or maybe a crazy animal that wants to hunt you by stabbing you. <laughs> like, you can only get this in the US, like nowhere else, where like the odd ones out, where <laughs> we have like these crazy the United, animals. The United States is something else. Yeah? I mean, like... <laughs> who boy? Yeah. Like, I, I don't know how we've made it this far. Yeah, I don't know either, but we're making it, and we will probably keep it that way forever. Somehow. Yeah. Well... I think this might be... a good first episode... Yeah, we've been... Oh, wow, we've even reached the hour. Like, an hour and two minutes. Wow, we're gonna get AdSense. No, we're not. But we're yeah. gonna get AdSense. Yay! I can't... No, we can't even get money because we have to get, like, a thousand or more. Um, <laughs> we're gonna make all but negative ten dollars on this. Yippee! Yay! So... Oh. Yeah, we did pretty good today, honestly, for the first podcast. Um, yeah, what should we call this? The Earwax Adventures? Yeah. Ooh. Oh, sorry. Oh my gosh. Like, uh, like, like two pieces of dust landed at the front of the computer, and I thought there were like two spiders waiting for me. I was like, oh my gosh. <laughs> Man, the spiders. Who the spiders are trying to trick me today? <laughs> <laughs> That's nice. Yeah, but yeah, maybe the first day. Yeah, so it's going to be called The Podcast, but I mean, every episode it's going to be called, like, something, like, The Whatever. So today is The, the Earwax Adventures. <laughs> yes. So. The earwax Adventures. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Alright. Well. Yeah, so. To, to whoever may be listening, um, I'm sorry. This is. This is uncut. This just is all the, the. This is this is going to be like this every episode, and this is all uncut. This is, like there is no preparation. Yeah, we don't have a very like a schedule yet, so we're just this is going to be like a random like every now and then like you just get like a random video of this. So <laughs> maybe maybe we should have like a instead of a black. No, you know what? We're going to keep the black screen. Yeah, because, I mean, a podcast is designed for listening. And it's yeah. just... Yeah. Um, so... 
Yeah, hope everyone enjoyed. Uh, all, all two people listening to it. Um, we hope you enjoyed it. Yeah, um, link to uh, my friend's channel down in, into the description. And, you know, support him with his music. Yes, I write music, and that's all you need to know. Yeah, and I, I don't really do a whole lot. I'm lazy, but... <laughs> I only write music when I have the motivation and I'm not a depressed person. Yeah. Music is a good way to to make stuff and express stuff. So. Yes. So, yeah, we reached the conclusion. Yes, I wonder I wonder what misadventures we will have next time. Yeah. I wonder what this yeah, I wonder what the topic is going to be. Maybe, I don't know. Yeah, maybe it could be just us, or maybe there's a special guest. I don't know. There's always Rashad. a. Ch- yeah, I don't know. There's always a chance for something, you know. It could be random. This just podcast is random, as you can tell. So. Yes. It's okay. called the podcast. Yeah, it's called the podcast for a reason. Anything can happen. <laughs> so. Eggs. Uh... Yeah. So yeah, hope everyone enjoyed it, and yeah. Alright. Alright. Podcast out.